Hello everybody, welcome to LT Gaming. My name is Tom and today we are looking at seven games to grind this Christmas. Tis the season, LT Gamers. The time to eat, drink and be merry with friends and family. Or avoid that altogether and lock yourself away and dedicate all those waking hours to grinding your favourite games. And we got your back here. We have curated a list of seven games to pick up this holiday season. These games are what we are currently playing between Luke and I. So let us know what you think of them below and comment your own recommendations for us all to see. And of course, feel free whilst you're down there to like and subscribe. All right, let's get started. X4 Foundations. If you know our channel, you know we love space games. And what better than a huge space sandbox simulator? Trade, flight, build, think is the tagline of this game and it perfectly sums up the experience. If scope and magnitude are your thing, then you cannot go wrong here. With the 5.0 update out now, it is a great time to check out this game again. Be it a lone pilot drifting the cosmos or a thrifty intergalactic magnate managing a vast empire, you will find something to while away your holiday hours. Skyrim. Despite being over a decade old, there is no better game than to dive into when you have some time than Skyrim. If this game had remained unchanged, it definitely would have not made this list. However, the magical world of modding never rests. So from the FXAA injector and 2K texture mods for visuals, to immersion mods like Enhanced Blood and Pure Weather, there is a whole wealth of things to unpack here. My personal favorites are the ones that add something new to the gameplay. And there are so many to choose from, and I won't list them all here, but I can personally recommend Cutting Room Floor, which is a mod that adds all the content that never made it into the vanilla cut of the game for whatever reason, and so adds a whole wealth of quests and content for you to dive into. Any others to recommend, please let me know in the comments as you know I'm always on the lookout for kind of new Skyrim mods to dive into and uh, waste some time in the magical world of Tamriel. Onan Exiles. Open Sandbox? Check. Online Persistent Survival Multiplayer? Check. A game inspired by Conan? That's three checks, Elfie Gamers. Enter a world steeped in lore, secrets, and of course, fights. Now throw that into a multiplayer arena where raids, building, and betrayal is commonplace, and you have a winner. Luke and I have played epic runs that number in the hundreds of hours as we built giant ugly bases, destroyed people, got destroyed in return, and everything in between. So from commanding thralls and beasts to summoning gods, this game has a lot to unpack. We will definitely be revisiting uh, this game over Christmas. We've actually planned uh, a playthrough uh, that we may or may not film, but let us know if you want to jump into the LT clan in Conan and uh, join us on our playthrough and adventures there. Uh, a big recommendation from us. EU4. Many holiday memories for me center around waging epic wars across the continent, as either someone like Prussia using my super soldiers to crush all my foes, or attempting to restore the Roman Empire as a small nation in Europe. Sometimes there has been success and sometimes there has been failure, but there's always been a lot of fun. EU4 is one of my favorite strategy games, offering a perfect blend of grand historical strategy and that fun. 
So if you are looking to lose a couple hundred hours into this game, I can definitely recommend this one for a holiday playthrough. Path of Exile A good indicator of a grindy game is usually to check the playtime of the reviewers. And a quick glance at my current screen reveals why Path of Exile is dangerous to your time. Having sunk many hours myself into this ARPG, I can attest to this fact. Originally seen as a spiritual successor to Diablo, I do believe that this game has earned the right to be considered a modern classic in its own right. With insane bosses, vast worlds, and literally thousands of variations amongst the builds, this is a great game to pick up if you're looking to avoid the traditional family rowing. Oh, and did I mention it's also for free. Dwarf Fortress Some games are designed to be time sinks. And after having spent about an hour going through my game options and then exploring my generated world, on my first playthrough of the new Steam release. I think it is safe to say that this game falls into that category. The new Steam version has been reviewed exceptionally highly and has been received critically incredibly well. I believe IGN gave it a 10 out of 10. I see this game as becoming a massive one for the future. So if creating a world for you to you know, have your fortress of dwarves to live in, thrive in, and you know tackle all these obstacles together. Sounds like a fun holiday challenge for you and a worthy time investment. Then we're definitely on the same page. And I'll look forward to covering this one in the future. Final Fantasy VII Remake. The moment I loaded up this remake, I knew I was making a serious time commitment. The music, the characters, and the vibe all take me back to 1997 and playing this masterpiece once again for the first time. With the recent PC release, I've just been looking for the right time to dive in and explore the Mako powered streets of Midgar once again. And so far, I'm about 30 hours into my first run, and I'm not disappointed. This is my number one game for this holiday season. Call me nostalgic, but, you know, I absolutely adore this series. Can definitely recommend picking it up. There we have it, LT Gamers. Seven games across multiple genres for you to dive into and lock yourself away from the stresses of work, school, family, whatever it may be. Do you like our list? Do you think we missed something? Have a great recommendation for us. Let us know in the comments below. Luke and I, you know, we're really grateful and appreciate all the interaction that we get. So, you know, I'm really keen to encourage this. And while you're down there, you know, consider helping us out with a like and if you, you know, enjoy our content, consider a subscription as well if you want. Have a great holiday season, guys, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Bye-bye now.